What's the haps? I'm Maroka and welcome to the Advent of Indies for December 8th. Today's developer is Minor Key Games and the freebie game over at adventofindies.com is You Have to Win the Game. This is available on Steam completely for free. Uh, Steam in their usual fashion market as being free to play but it does not come with the usual negative connotations that such a phrase would generally inspire. It's not going to poke you with microtransactions and things. It is ju it's just free and you can play it. So it is free to play in that kind of sense. So you can go, go over to Steam and download that. There's a link obviously at the Advent of Indies website which is linked below. And the uh, promoted game alongside that is a Super Win the Game which is actually the sequel to this. So this is kind of a, a retro styled 80s PC kind of styled exploration platform thing. Uh, so I'm going to start my timer, uh, as we do. That's what we do around here. So we're going to start a timer and I'm going to give it 15 minutes, like always. So with the timer begins, new game. In fact, let me just clear that timer. You have to win the game original by J. Kyle Pittman, piratehearts.com. This is a default campaign, start here. And then we've got extra spicy, this is a more difficult remix campaign. Okay, original. Normal YOLO mode and playable cat DLC. You're a cat, you have nine lives. Disables checkpoint YOLO mode, you only live once, right, fair enough, yeah, that would make sense. Disables checkpoint savings and enables permadeath, right, and well, I think we'll go with normal. And we'll hit the start timer. Pirate Hearts presents something on a, on a very plasticky looking monitor. I think, you, yeah, we actually get to play this on the monitor, don't we? Yep. That's, that's how the entire game is framed by this monitor. So they've gone right, they've gone very, very, very realistic with the aesthetic. Right down to the slightly greyish white plastic monitor. Excellent. You have to start the game. Okay. So W, uh, no, W, is WASD move? WASD is move, but also so are the arrow keys. Space is jump. That works. ENF do nothing. One, two, three. Surrounding keys. Oh, Z, X, C. ZX a jump as well. There are many jump keys. There are all the jump keys. I think I'll stick with WSD and touch the bell. Die in the spikes. Three respawn. Kiss principle. Keep it simple. Stupid, I presume. Touch the bell. Die in the spikes. Respawn at the bell. Okay. Just to make sure we know. Yay! There's an achievement for that one as well. Whee! There's not an achievement for that one. That one was me mistiming my jump. Is there going to be a bell in every room? Maybe. If it's... I'm getting a... Oh, this is kind of weird the way the camera... Well, because the screen's kind of curved, so the, it kind of the graphics change as you walk towards the edge of the screen. That's kind of weird, but I suppose that that's what they're emulating. Down is just drop straight down. That looks like a bag of money. Can I get to the bag of money? Maybe not. Uh, so yeah, I, I'm getting the impression this may play a little bit... Oh yeah, get the bag of money. A bit, uh, what am I thinking of? V, 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 As in, it's going to kill you a lot, I think. So hit the bell. Uh, there is danger that way. Let's go see what what danger holds. Spikes, bats, things that want me dead. Oh, okay. I see, I can do that. Okay, now what? I can't get up those spikes. I suppose I can... Okay, I just go back to the respawn point, and all the things I've collected stay collected. The floors that I've d deleted stay deleted, so... Okay. Hang on, does it, does it come back if I leave the room? It does. I still have no idea how I would get up those spikes, and I probably shouldn't expect to try and get up those spikes, so let's not do that. They are not there. Oh, there's a little percentage completion in the corner I hadn't noticed. So... Oh, okay. That was very V V V V V V. And each room's got its own name as well. Yeah, I'm seeing a lot of similarities there. Although, uh that kind of just had a very that had a very, very minimalistic style. This is obviously emulating a very specific style. I'm not necessarily sure it's my favourite style. I don't think I d I'm not a fan of the style of games from this era, and there are a lot of people who do kind of like seem to like that thing and people keep making games in this style. Not my cup of tea, to be honest, but hey, each their own. I have absolutely terrible taste. So, that's where I was going. Alright, I want... Is there not a bell in this room? 
I guess there isn't. Can I jump? Now how would I get across to that? What I, what I want, I'm trying to get over to those spikes, evidently. Uh, across there, no. Good lord. How I do. I can't jump anywhere near far enough to get across them, no. I wonder if I'll unlock more tools and things. I wonder if it's a bit Metroidvania-y, maybe? I don't know. I mean, so far as I would unlock more things. Because there's a lot of things that seem to be out of reach. What is the magic word? Please? Can I get across? Oh. Oh, I die in water as well. They did not explain that at the start. I feel cheated. Although, I could probably have figured that out. Many games of this ilk would kill you in water. I should probably have figured that out. Is there a map? Can I bring up a map? Does M bring up a map? Tab? Pressing the usual suspects. No, none of them are map. So, is this a make a map on a piece of paper and figure it out yourself kind of thing? Yeah, there's a lot of these greeny dot things there which would suggest I can make a bridge there somehow at some point. But not yet. Not yet. That was a one-way drop. Oh, hang on. Can I... I can't get up there. That's a one-way drop. I thought I thought the vines looked like I might have been able to climb them. Nope. No vine climbing. Mm. Can you tell I've just recorded the podcast? My voice is sore. <laughs> is this a boss thing? This seems... bullet helly. Oh, come on. Damn it. I'm gonna do that. I am going to do that. Oh, that's depleted. Um, okay. I'm not gonna do this. Oh my god! Oh, I did it! Yes! I got an orb thing! Achievement unlocked. Kind of blue. Ah, right. So that... Re that... I guess all the things that were kind of blue... that They looked greener than that before, but okay. So we now got kind of blue bridges. Wherever kind of blue is required. So I guess I wasn't... Well, bosses generally... One would sort of typically kill a boss. Like, that wasn't a boss in the sense that I killed it, but... Okay, how I do... Can I get? Can I jump high enough to get onto that? I think I should be able to, but... Nope. No, I can't. More upgrades required? Okay, I can't... There's, I don't know why I thought there was a duck. There is no duck. Jump over... Oh, come on! Yeah, this is one of those games that is very, very frustrating. It's for the kind of person who likes a frustrating game. I am not that kind of person. I play a lot of visual novels, for Christ's sake. I like games where there is no consequence for being stupid. Well, you can't really be stupid in a visual novel. It's just kind of, you play it. That's what it does. You just you don't even play it. There's not much to play. You just enjoy the experience. I like experiences. If you die a lot on things, you don't get quite as much experience out of it. So it's not my cup of tea. I don't know if I can get through that. That looks horrifying. How far does this come? To about there? Okay, nope. That's not how that works. How uh, is this doable? No. Oh, okay. I kind of see if there's kind of a rhythm to it. Oh, come on. Nope. Oh, come on. There's a bell at the bottom. If I can get to the bottom, I could do that. Nope. God damn it. I can do this. I can totally do this. And down. Yeah! Oh yeah! How do I do this? Can I get under that? Is there room on the other side of that? Okay, I guess there is. What? <laughs> no. Oh, uh, there's not even a way back up. I've got to do this now. I've locked myself into a place where I can only go this way. Oh, the f oh no, 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 no. N nuts to everything about this. What the hell? This is... There's like one pixel wide gap. One pixel to the left you hit the orb, one pixel to the right you hit the spike. That's a horrible place, no. Such precision is just unreasonable to ask for. No, no, no. 
No, that was just... Okay, no, go. Ah! Ah! Go. No! One pixel further would have been nice. No, why did I go then? No! I'm out of sync, I'm out of rhythm. Go. Okay, that's one. Okay. Go. And through. Woo! Uh, bell. Yes, give me the bell. God damn, give me the bell. And they, they fall on spikes. You definitely shouldn't go left. I can't argue with that. Wait a second. How did I get here? Oh, you bastard. No. No, 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 no. You bastard. Why? Why did I not listen to the writing on the wall? Oh, you utter. That's a dick move. Oh my god. Oh, what the hell? Oh, are you kidding me? Why would you do that? Oh my god. Oh. That's just nasty. That's mean. That's really mean. Oh my god, no. No. I don't like this kind of game. This is not my thing. Oh, god damn it. Ah! Okay, that's one. Over the spike? No. Now, can I jump the spike on the orb? Maybe. Is that reasonable to ask for? No. I need to get past the first one first. No, no, no. Okay, go. No. Go. No. Oh, come on. No. No. Ah! Ah! Come on! <laughs> hate all my hate. Oh, I, just... I won't go left. I promise I won't go left if you just let me through. Oh, the spike. For no. I don't know that I'm going to make it to 15 minutes before I just rage quit. No. All my nope. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. I don't like the style, I don't like the concept. I'm sure there are many people out there who like this kind of thing. I am not a sucker for punishment. I like a game that I can enjoy and this is not a game I can enjoy. God. One more time, come on. Okay. Ah, Jesus. No. No. Hate this. Right, no. I don't have oh, the pixel perfect control it requires of me. I don't know how any human could. Okay, that's that. Okay, go up and through. Up and through. Right, let's grab that bell. Fall through here. Definitely shouldn't go left. Maybe I won't. Okay, that goes. Oh, really? Uh. 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 It was easy to do when it was slow. Okay, I guess we're going right. I can't go down. I definitely shouldn't go left. Ugh. We've got to go right over all the nasties. These are out of sync in a really inconvenient way. Oh, man. And the bat's out of sync as well, so I need the planets to align here, basically. I need these platforms to line up as well as the bat to line up. Otherwise, I get a spike in the face. How? This is just unreasonable. This is thoroughly unreasonable. Everything about this game is unreasonable. I don't like this game. Okay, and I oh, that almost looked like maybe I could kind of just sort of a little bit, maybe, made it. Oh, you son of a god freaking ah, ah. No. Oh, oh god. I don't think I knew what I was getting into when I started this. I thought it was going to be one of those nasty games, but I oh, this is just I don't like rage games. So I don't understand the appeal of them. Ah, 15% complete. Good lord. I will recommend, however, on at least Xbox Live Arcade, I don't know if it's anywhere else, there's a game that's kind of like this, but not ragey. It's actually nice and fun and nice. It's called Laser Cat. Go play it. Actually, I believe I... Actually, it's on Desora as well, actually. That's where I first found it. 
This is on a, I know it's like Xbox Live Arcade, but I first found it on Desora. And it's a fun little game and you should totally go play that. I don't know where I'm jumping here, where am I jumping? I want to be... What the... Oh, okay. Drop through the first floor, land on there. Right, cool. Bag of money. Contrived lock and key me mechanisms. I guess I can't get to that. So yeah, V V V V V V, you know, six Vs. That's 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 pretty cool. It's nasty, but not unreasonably nasty. Haven't I already been this way? I don't know. I think I have. I'm not sure. I feel like I'm going in circles now. I feel like I'm in this way. Yes, V uh V V V V V V. That's pretty cool. That's not unreasonably horrible. And Laser Cat is good. Those are both games in this kind of vain genre kind of thing and they're nice and they're fun and I enjoy them and I will recommend them and not having a fun day with this thing but as I say some people get their kicks out of rage games and hey what can I say if you want a free rage game here's a free rage game I am rapidly approaching the 15 minute mark so here in the loneliest corner where actually I think is this a dead end? God damn it, I've, all this way, I come all this way and it's a dead end. Yes, I think that will probably be quite enough of this nonsense, good lord. This is You Have to Win the Game, available for free on Steam. But, I, go, I ain't gonna recommend it. But I have absolutely no doubt in my mind that there'll be plenty of people out there who would like this kind of thing. What is the magic symbol? Don't know? Don't care. Thank you very much for watching. I've been Maroka. I'll see you more in the tomorrow. Yeah!